So what, how do you think ICT can help you? It can help me to you reach out. Sorry, you asked a very critical question and she answered. Yes. But the answer, that is the other answer. You asked how many people do you have in your WhatsApp? WhatsApp? It said 200. It is 200 times the number of persons or not. Because you can be in one group. Ordinary one group like this, absolutely. You have 200. So you should write. So you have 200 people. You have 200 people on your WhatsApp. Or you are part of groups. Are you in a group? <laughs> now, let me just give you one example. What's your name? Rosemary. Extra lesson in English or mathematics. And you post it on your WhatsApp platform. There's a possibility that 10 people will contact you that want you to come and teach their children in the comfort of their home. I'm trying to explain to you how ICT can improve your business. And it's level upon level. Some you don't need to send a word. They call it um, block messaging. Some it is a flyer. Please sit down that. Some it is a flyer like this. And you post it. You will be surprised about how many people will come and patronize you. You cannot leave this training and not improve on whatever it is you're doing. I just want to ask a question from this. A lot of people use WhatsApp just for social engagement. But WhatsApp is actually, I, I use it to communicate with other staff. So I have a group of staff that are accounting department. I have a group of staff that are power and attendant. So when I went, whenever I want to send a group message, I just send it through that WhatsApp. But that's not the only thing. You have Facebook. What do you use your Facebook for? Social engagement. Who have Facebook? So you have not spoken. Whenever I do a customer, I will snap it and post it. You will take the picture of the customer and post it on Facebook. Do people like? Yes. Has anybody contacted you to come and do hair for them before? Yeah. So a lot of people use Facebook to dancing, Bobrowski. That's rubbish. This is somebody who has used Facebook to promote her business. And all she would do is, when she has a customer, you don't know whether they say, sorry I'm putting you around, she will say, what kind can you feel do? Yeah, check my Facebook page, you will see. And through there, the customer will just go through, oh, can you do this? This is what I wanted to do. And after finishing with that customer, what will she do again? She will post my customer again. That is using the power of ISIS to promote her business. And can I just ask who else thinks they use who else thinks they use Facebook to promote their business here? <coughs> what do you do? How do you do it? A place called Marketplace. That's one of the biggest market I know. Market there's somewhere on Facebook that is called Marketplace. That's where she goes into. I just ICT has grown women radio. Businesses come because on our website, because I heard them speak on our website today, on our website page, our contact telephone number is there, our rate card is there, and the programs we do are there. So if my sister has um, ICT, she will put the kind of hair she can do there, she will put samples there, and she will put a contact telephone number there. For my sister that sells Iru, she will have to put the nice photograph of Iru there, how she cooks Iru, she can do a video, how she uses Iru for food. She will put her contact telephone number there. She can put the ingredients of Iru, the benefits of Iru. So for instance, if Iru helps you to bring your low blood pressure down, I'm just using that as an example, or it helps it does. She will put it there and people will contact her because she's giving them information. So what do you, why do you have to use IC? ICT would help you to retain your customer. As I said, Women Radio, when we started, maybe we had about 5,000 um, people. Today, I don't know how much we have, but I think it's in its 50,000. We continue to retain those customers there because we don't want them to go. So we give them what they want. Most of our customers are women. We give them information on health. We give them information on education. We are hoping to add ICT to what we do on Women Radio. So that when you go on the page, there is something
it for you. If you are going through domestic violence, the telephone number is there, depending on where you live. So you use it to retain customers, to give them information. You will use it to boost revenue. People contact us, and from there, we're able to give them businesses. We're able, they're able to pay and promote their businesses. You use it to promote growth. Because if you have 10 customers, when more people know about you, there is a possibility, right, that they will introduce you or more will come. That is what ICD has done for women radio. It gives us visibility. We're just in Areco. I'm sure people, a lot of people do not know who are, where Areco is. But from women, you don't know. Well, you know where we are, okay? And so from Areco, people listen to us anywhere in the world. ICT will give your business visibility. Then you use it to take stock. There are some people, let me, let me give an example of stock, for instance. I, I, we were talking this morning. Pure water and bottled water. When you use ICT to store information, you know what customers like bottled water. You know which customers like pure water. And you are able to take stock of which of them would I buy more. If more people are buying pure water, does it make any sense for you to invest in bottled water? That is what the data does for you. It also helps you to address leakages. So for instance, you have got um, 20 cartons of water. And then the money that is being given to you is not representing the 20 cartons of water. You can address it and find out where is the money going to. That is what your ICT will help for you. And it helps you to change according to market conditions. I understand that during dry season, we consume more water. So when it's cold season, why should you invest in more water? Let me tell you the other thing ICT can do for the person that sells body. There's a, if a woman sells body outside here, and it's only these people in this vicinity that know, there is an estate down the road there. They may not even know she exists. But if she puts, if she uses ICT to create awareness for her, herself or himself, then people can patronize her more. And then you can deliver your body if you want to deliver your body. Now, what you also do matter, you sell Iru, right? If you do not sell quality Iru, and you use ICT to promote yourself, you will you destroy your business. Because those who buy your Iru will go on ICT, they will use ICT to say that don't buy Iru from now, it's fake Iru. And that is what happens. But if you, if you ensure that whatever you do, whether it's a service, like school, thank you very much, whether it's a service like school, or it's you, make sure the quality is good, so that your customer can keep, uh, what is the word? Tell me. Hey, no, 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 what, what um, advertise you. They will advertise you. They will tell other people how good your business and your service is. Give quality products and service. Give good service, whether physical or online. Give good service to retain and attract customers. They say customer is king, trust me. Even when the customer is wrong, still make them feel king because they pay your bill. Acknowledge the customer. Accept complaints. The complaint is a good tool. When you sell bad you and they complain, call them, apologize. Send them a better Iru, give them extra. That is what they will tell others. That that person handles Iru well, handles customer service well. If you have a good product, remember you must have a good product, you must have a good service, then ICT will help your business to grow better. Use ICT to connect and retain customers. So, what we want to do, what I want to do here today, I've told you how ICT has helped women radio to grow. And people actually do complain about some of the programs we do that they don't like. Because women radio is women driven. Any program we do is women driven. And we rely on what the women tell us they want us to do. And so what I can do to support you here today with, with my sister is that six women here today, I don't know them, you will decide them. We will give you free promo on women radio. Wow. Wow. Six women. They will decide who the six women are. As I said, women will be six years old in December. So we might as well um, give back to what the community has given us. Well. So we have a here. We will identify six of you. We will give you one hour of radio. Wow. One hour is about one hour. It's about one hour. Oh, no, no, no.
six, six free air time to promote your business and promote your services. <laughs> when you are not good in the ICT, I know they have taught you a lot here. Please, I want you to leave here today. Take a photograph, joint photograph, push it out on Instagram. You can use Twitter now. Push it out on Instagram, push it out on Facebook, push it out on WhatsApp and say, I have attended this training. This is what I do. Make sure you patronize us. Push yourselves out. I hope you will have a WhatsApp platform yes. for all of you. Yes. And then you can start promoting your businesses there. Whatever it is you do, please do it well and do it differently. Do something differently from what other persons are doing. I wish you all the best. Thank you.